to pick up my package I'm here at Minute Maid Park. I hate coming over here. It is just so hectic to drive over here, no matter what time. That's why I left early. If you didn't know, I'm an anxious driver. Very anxious driver. Anyway, I'm gonna go inside, I'm gonna pick up my packet, and go on about my business. Super excited about already being here. It is 10:30 uh, ish so go inside and get it. making people uncomfortable when I'm filming. Yes, it's like very weird for me, but it makes other people like more uncomfortable. Anyway, Hi, Angela here. Welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for tuning in to watch another video. If you're new here, my name is Angela. I lost 200 pounds, fell in love with running. Now I'm trying to live the healthiest life I possibly can while being a mom. Today is a day about me. I'm going to take it. I kind of feel like that I need to be working. I have other things that I need to do because in 2022, I said that I was going to treat like this content creation thing as my full-time job you know you want it to happen then you have to put in the work but i'm also chilling out i'm running a race tomorrow and i had to come pick up my packets and i have all day so i can't check into my hotel so i'm chilling in my car so i'm gonna do the same old same old i'm gonna go to the outlet mall but for the first time i'm going to eat why every time i start recording then um, my phone starts turning. Anyway, I'm eating from Zoe's Kitchen. It's not my favorite, but it stays in step with my new way of eating. Tonight, I'll go off the rails, but for now, I'm going to eat some lentil soup, and I'm going to have a salad, and then we're going to go do things that I want to do. I'm by myself, so I guess I need to enjoy the time of being by myself. Still thinking about my tot though, because she had a spelling test today and that's all I can think about is, I hope she does well on her spelling test. That's crazy that that's what life has made you. Hummus, pita, there's supposed to be some chicken and some salad in here, but I don't know if that's there, but that's what I ordered. We'll take it for what it is and we're gonna sit here and eat and I guess I'll watch a video. But I'll catch up with you later. I just wanted to go ahead and open it up. Now that I've finished eating my um, uh -oh. my room is ready, but they won't give me my key. I have to go by the front desk. Of course it is, because I'm here and I already made the plans. Yeah. Anyway, so Greek food makes your breath smell like. Ugh. I'm actually kind of glad that we are wearing masks. For that reason okay so i was sitting over there debating whether or not i should go to stores over there or if i should go to stores over here and i'm like angela it's your me day you don't need to be stressing out about stuff that doesn't matter so like i feel like when i come to houston i have to do all i have to go to all these stores and do all these things that i can't do at home because like our stores at home have absolutely nothing in them but then we go other places and then those stores have stuff in them so like i feel the need to like have to go do all of the all of the things and i kind of put pressure on myself to go do that but you know hey it's a chill day and i'm going to be chill and right now i'm gonna go find myself a new backpack i think and i'm gonna go to airy because i'm obsessed yeah me like it every time you wake up with no makeup, me like it. How you call my name up? Got 
me feeling way up. Me like it. Haters trying to break us. Them know they can shake us. Me like it. Baby, me no chaser. Get ready to take off. Okay. Yeah. Up, up, and away we go. I can never find no There's a coach backpack that I kind of want so bad. It's 150 something dollars. But I don't need to spend the money. I don't know. Decisions. All right, I'm sitting here in my car debating on whether or not I should go back and get that bag from Coach. It was, it's just a little backpack-like purse, but it looks nicer, and, you know, that's all about my vibe. I did find a cute um, backpack that I think is going to be very functional, um, better than the one that I bought from Very Bradley for a very good price, so I'm not mad about that but to go back in to buy the purse or not. I just don't know. I also kind of do want a Starbucks, so I'd have to get out of the car to go get that. But if I get out of the car to get Starbucks, I'm going back to get that bag. I know it. I already know. All right, I decided to make a stop. I feel like that this vlog is just like a previous vlog. But um, anyway, mommy day. I'm going to get some crumbled cookies and I need to go ahead and get to my hotel before rush hour traffic because nobody wants to get caught in that. Um, so are they open? Yes. What are the cookies for today? Let's find out what the cookies are. It doesn't tell me what the cookies are. Oh, they open at 8 a.m. Who wants cookies at 8 a.m.? Just, just wondering. Oh, I have the app. A box of six cookies is 20 bucks. Okay, so we can just get a, let's get a party box, y'all. No, we're going to get a box of four. So let's see. We, they have cinnamon fly bread, raspberry lemonade, oatmeal featuring Rolo, chocolate cake, classic pink sugar, or milk chocolate. I'm gonna be real with you. I think I'm gonna pass on the crumble because none of these cookies seem good. Um, they switch out the flavors every week, but none of these, yeah, no crumble today. All right, sorry for the brief intermission, but it's just not happening. Later. I'm at my hotel now, so I'm gonna go ahead and check in. And if you don't know, I'm a Hilton stan. Like, I've been staying at Hilton's for like the past 10 years or whatever, since I started my running journey. Sponsor me that's really all I say but um yeah so I'm about to go check into my hotel and I know that it's nice because we stayed here in November so that's all I can ask for then I think I'm gonna take some chill out time okay I have arrived I'm in the hotel I don't know is it just me or was when anyone gets to a hotel they automatically have to use the bathroom I don't know didn't have to use it until I had to get to the door of my hotel room. And then I was like, all of a sudden I had to go. TMI. Okay, so here is a little room tour here. You've already seen this before, I think. But here we go. We have this nice mirror right here. It's not focusing. Mirror, yay. And then we got a kitchen. Oh, so look microwave cooktop nice refrigerator dishwasher a nice little desk area i live for the desk area a little couch if talk was here then she would be all over this the tv and the bed the bathroom area very nice Homewood Suites are like the oldest, one of the oldest hotels in the brand. So they're usually like not new and not this nice. But this one is nice. And I like saying here, it's not remotely close to where I need to be tomorrow, but it's in an area where I'm comfortable. And it's by Ikea. If I wanted to go to Ikea, you know, I'm going to go to Trader Joe's and I want to go to Whole Foods to see if they have my kombucha little pop thing, my prebiotic soda. But um, I wanted to go ahead and get here before traffic got chaotic because I had to go through many, many lanes. So I think I'm just gonna chill out for right now. I'm gonna call my husband. And yeah, still haven't heard anything about that spelling test. Still waiting. 
right, I was sitting here and I talked to Lily and I was watching some YouTube and I really need to start editing my video, but I don't feel like it. So it's a whole mindset thing. I guess I can show you the stuff that I bought earlier, but I want some coffee. So me day, I'm gonna go get some coffee and I might go to Trader Joe's since I'll already kind of be over there and then um, Whole Foods. I really don't want to get stuck in traffic, so that's what I'm really concerned about. But um, right now, it's time for coffee. And I need some chapstick or something. My lips are so dry, which means I didn't drink enough water today. Just in case you were wondering, I did leave the hotel at the wrong time because it's like super packed. Like the traffic, it's horrible. So I'm not going back over there right now. I'm just not. But it's only horrible on that one side of the street. I have no idea why. So, you know, I'm not used to that big city living. But there are lots of places around the hotel to eat. So that's nice. I just don't like traffic. Anxious driver. I'm back at the hotel. I have, I'm not going out again unless I need something. So I need to make sure that I have all of my running stuff. I picked up Payway, I went to Whole Foods. But how much stuff does one person need? I'm here for less than 24 hours. Like when I leave the hotel tomorrow, I'm not gonna have anything. Like I'm not, com I'm not coming back like in the morning. But like I have uh, the most stuff, no matter who I'm traveling with, I always have the most stuff. It's a little bit ridiculous. I need to learn how to downsize. Anyway. <laughs> I'm going to check to make sure that I have all of my running stuff so that I for sure don't have to go out anymore. So I'm gonna do that. And charge my GoPro because I realized that I left my GoPro battery. But guess what? That's why I ain't getting no more of my money for my mistakes. I have one battery, so once that goes dead, that's it. Like you, my baby. Oh. Would you be my number one? Number one, eh? Number one, number one, eh? Number one, number one, eh? Number one. Won't you be my number one? Number one, eh? Number one, number one, eh? Number one, number one, eh? Number one, yeah. I forgot to pack socks. I totally forgot. I was gonna go back and check it, but then I didn't pack any socks. Thankfully, I packed some other socks to wear for after the race, and I'll just have to wear those then. Crap. I cannot believe that I forgot compression socks. I don't even know if I'm gonna be able to make it through the run without my compression socks. Dang it. All right, I can't believe that I left, I left socks, but at least I have other socks. Just wanted to show you what I got in my swag bag. Everyone likes running the hot chocolate races because they give you jackets. So this is a very nice fleece jacket right here. It's got a little puffer effect. It's got pockets on it, which, you know, I appreciate pockets because I carry the most stuff. And they have a pocket on the sleeve. So, this is what you get for running the hot chocolate race. And, of course, you get your bib. And Honey Stinger was there, and they, were, they have, like, um, hydration things that I'm going to try, but I'm not going to try it tonight. I'll try it tomorrow. And, of course, you get your bib, and then... Uh, there's a bag check and then you get a finisher mug that has a, like chocolate, a banana, marshmallows, cookies, some stuff like that to dip. So I'll show you what that is at the end. Um, I don't really have a fond experience of the hot chocolate races. I've only run one and it was one of their summer races, which I think was the only summer race that they ever did. And it was in Austin and it was a horrible event for me. I got this and then I'm going to show you the stuff that I got today at the outlet mall. Okay, first up is from Vera Bradley. I got 
a blanket and it wraps up in itself. I already have one of these and I love it. And Todd tried to take one, so I got one for her. And then I did get this backpack right here. Look how massive that is on the bottom, but I have to carry around my computer, my cameras, all that. So it's got um, a zipper up here for the stuff. It's got a zipper pocket right here that holds pins and all of this. It's got another another area to hold more stuff and it's got another zipper on it so this is perfect for me because i'm always losing stuff then it's got another area right here with more storage i don't know if y'all can even see this and then there's a space back here to hold your computer so i think that this will satisfy all my needs it was 50% off and then an additional 30% off of the 50%. So um, it was a good deal on the backpack. And the backpack is made of recycled materials, which is important to me. So trying to be better and buy these types of items. But hopefully this will fit all my stuff. And then I went to Aerie and I was really looking for pajama pants because I love their pajama pants, but they didn't have any left. So I got these waffle knit pants. Then I went next door to American Eagle because you know they're the same. And then I got these mom joggers. And then also from Aerie, I got some of these offline, um, the hugger leggings. I love these so much. Oh, also, because people say that I never ever show when I'm not eating like the best. I just want to show you that I got oh break the I got a piece of cake from Whole Foods. It's berry chantilly and I'm super super excited to eat this tonight since I didn't get my crumble cookies. So I'm just gonna chill out. I really need to edit a video because I didn't do that earlier and I need to get rid of all of the most stuff that I ever had. Maybe I'll take that downstairs back into the car. But yeah that's it for right now. I'll touch back with you later. Baby, me no chase us. Nothing can replace us. Okay. Yeah. Up, up, and away we go. I can never find nobody like you, my baby. Oh, hit them one time. Yeah. All right. So I'm about to sit down and eat my food. I ordered Pele. I got brown rice, tofu, broccoli, and like bell peppers and stuff I got extra because that's what I'm gonna eat hopefully I won't be running to the bathroom tomorrow but yeah I'm sitting here I'm watching last chance to you I love last chance you and um, I'm gonna sit here eat my food and that's probably gonna be it for tonight I'm just packing up my stuff and making sure that I have everything together Thank you.